love. Almost six years ago, I went on a trip to Slovakia expecting and asking God to change my life. And looking at this day, and all of our days we've gone through together, He absolutely did. Lauren, my love, when I think back to when I first told you I loved you, I cannot help but feel if I was almost lying then. The feelings I held then are merely a shadow of the love I have for you today. But many people believe that entering marriage is a final step to their romantic relationship. And as they see it, a couple meets, they get to know each other, they fall in love, and they decide that they want to spend the rest of their life together, and that's the final step. But I want to change the picture of that because I believe that marriage is not the final step in the couple's relationship. It is actually just the beginning of a grand adventure, of a moment where you two get to become lifelong partners until the Lord calls you home. fathom how much I have grown in my love for you from then until now, and I am excited to think of how much more I will love you a year from now and beyond. I'm so happy our hearts found their way home to each other. I tried to pinpoint the exact moment I knew I wanted to marry you. This was much harder than expected because you have proven to me so many times, practically every day that you'll be an amazing spouse and the person that I want to spend the rest of my life with. Hey, beautiful. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh yeah, we definitely are gonna struggle doing our first dance in this. <laughs> mm. So beautiful. Oh my gosh. What a perfect dress for you. <laughs> tendency to be indecisive and unsure about things <laughs> but you are the only thing I've been undoubtedly certain of and I feel so extremely lucky and grateful to be marrying you today and to get to spend all of my tomorrows with you. I love you so much. You have taught me so much about what it means to love and I look forward to learning so much more together. My love, my wife, my answer to prayer, yours forever. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, you may kiss your bride. I love you too. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, introducing for the first time, uh, Torn and Lauren Shanta. Baby, we can go somewhere. We can get away from it. Make a different atmosphere. Go to 
out of outer space and then fall in love with aliens. Leave the human race down there. Please don't be afraid, darling. Even if the stars are falling, baby, you're a satellite like Aphrodite. And you'll be a god. Offer you a sacrifice, we'll build an army. You'll be in charge. But when we touch down, it's like. I'm so glad Lauren picked you to spend the rest of her life with. I've had the opportunity to watch your love for Lauren grow over the years. You have made an effort by spending dollars upon dollars on flights. Especially when you waited until the last minute and it was her birthday. <laughs> your love story feels handwoven and written by God. Your love inspires me every day. I love you both endlessly. When we touch down, it's like The first hour, we just saw that the two of you are so comfortable around each other. You mirror and match each other so well. You love the idiosyncrasies about each other. We were so excited because the two of you are perfect for each other. But when we touch down, it's like...